Well, hello my sleigh bunnies. Welcome to my channel. So today I created a fun blue eyeshadow look and blue is my favorite color and it's Easter weekend guys and we all in quarantine and of course I decided hey let me dress up to go in my living room so yeah so this is basically look I created if you want to see how I did this look do keep watching First, I'm gonna go in with the Arlene Villarule Pro Base and I'm using this for my eyeshadow base. I know I'm supposed to use less but I just can't help myself. I just love to use plenty of this product. <laughs> okay, so I'm going in with my Jeffree Star Blue Blood Palette and the first shade I'm taking on my crease area is the shade called I'm Cold and I'm just patting that shade and building it up onto the crease area well above the crease area basically next i'm gonna go in with the shade called blue blood and i'm gonna take that shade just under i'm cold i don't want to totally cover up as i need to create a kind of gradient effect As you guys can see, I'm not doing any swiping motions. I'm trying my best to build up the intensity of the pigments. So now I'm going back in with the shade called I'm Cold because I may have lost some of that color while building up Blue Blood. So now I'm going to take the shade called Priceless and I'm applying that shade just above my brow bone area and then I'm going to highlight under my brow in just one little spot with the shade called Cullinan which is a white shimmery shade. I'm, I'm not doing the whole area with this, okay, just that high point. So now I'm going to build up the shade called Power and this is such a unique blue shade. I am going to definitely take my time with this. As you can see, I'm pressing in the shadows and working it onto the lid. And you definitely have to be patient when you're trying to build up the intensity of this color in particular. I do want to say that this look can be achieved using any blue eyeshadow you have it does not have to be Jeffree Star as long as you have a proper base for your eyeshadow it's gonna pop just the same so now I'm gonna go ahead and do my foundation and concealer off camera so now I'm going in with the shade blue blood in my lower lash area and I'm just gently patting on the shade. So next, I'm going to pick up my LA Girl Gel Eyeliner Pencil and I'm going to go ahead and line my waterline and make it nice and smoky. So next I'm going to go ahead and create my wing using my Inglot AMC 77 gel liner and I'm applying that using my Zoeva 317 wing liner brush. So 
And now I'm going to jump in with my Shop Miss A AOA Brow Pomade. And this is the US $1 Pomade. And you can't go wrong with this pomade because for $1 it does such a bomb job. By the way guys, do excuse my crippled eyebrow brush. This is basically an old cheap brow brush that I just pick up that I just never throw away because I mean it still does the job. This fully side fell out but hey. And now I'm going to highlight my inner corners of my eyes using the shade Cullinan in the Jeffree Star palette. And now I'm contouring my nose and the rest of my face using my Colourpop bronzer. I think the shade of this bronzer is called After Dark if I'm not mistaken. It's not written anywhere on it but I think it's After Dark, yeah. Is one of my favorite Colourpop bronzers. The shade is just perfect for my skin tone. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply a little bit of blush and this is a peach shade from Ofra. And now guys, I'm going to highlight my nose, my cupid's bow, and my face. And I'm actually using an eyeshadow from the Fenty Beauty um, palette. It's got this kind of pink iridescent um, flip to it. I think the shade is called More Rock and Ice. Yeah. So now I'm going in with my Arlene Velarul Pro Base to cut a crease. And I'm not going all the way, I'm just doing this at the center of my lid. And I'm going to apply that shade Cullinan right over that just to set it. Because I want it to remain white and that shade Cullinan is just the right shade, a frost white. So I'm just popping on some natural lashes off camera. You can still see the difference even though it's natural lashes. So let me do my lips and I'm going in with my Too Faced Matte Liquid Lipstick. And this is such a pretty nude peachy shade. So now I'm going to go ahead and set my face with the iconic London Prep Set and Mist. This is like a glue mist. And that's basically it for this look. So guys, that's basically the look I created today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always. And I know it's been a minute since I created some content for you guys to watch. I've been struggling to get the time because, you know, spending all the time with your family these days, you know how it is. So, do check out my business pages on Facebook and Instagram, Slay by Candy Bee, and do subscribe subscribe to my channel subscribe what you waiting for subscribe because it's only 3.99 yeah anyway guys do stay home keep yourselves in quarantine you know we have to do our parts because i just wish you all knew how serious it is a lot of you are just taking this thing for granted this covid 19 in trinidad and it is so much more serious than what the government is telling you all. So please, please guys, 
do the right thing stay home don't go anywhere just stay in quarantine i'm begging you guys so that's it that's all folks <laughs> bye